Good morning, everyone. It's Rita here, and today is hashtag stash go. And so I'm going to draw a, a number um, and a project out of my little box. We've only got three left. So let me draw that, and then I may have to stop and go figure out what I'm going to make. Um, okay, so this is journal cards decorated with birds or bees. Could have used that a little earlier. But the number is 22. So I'm just going to make some journal cards decorated with birds or bees. I'll have to think about... Um, I'll probably just do birds because I don't think I have bees right now. Um, yeah, let's see. I'm trying to think if I can do something special with birds. Hmm. Or a special journal card type thing. All right, well, I'll be back and uh, we'll get started on it, okay? Hold on. Okay, I'm back. So, um, because it's journal cards and I have all of these blanks, uh, when it came to mind, I'm like, what should I use for the, the journal cards itself? And I have all these blanks. I also have these cutoffs from the journal I just finished not too long ago. And um, I thought, well, maybe I could use this as the background of a journal card or I could use this as the background of one of the other cards I don't know they're so I have all of these um, I don't know what they call them they call them something uh, project cards I think and um, so I thought I could use these however the back is very white and we have to have enough to uh, make sure that this doesn't show through so that's one thing but that can be used these are whoops dump over my box um these are um when years ago when people used to move and they would send you a postcard or something with your their new address on it um so the how oh, it has birds on it how cute so I could work around that actually I don't know no. but this is a good background for um, writing on I might have to use some of those so I don't have to take too much time to make these and then uh, if you remember I took a bunch of my mom's um, cards birthday cards and things that she saved every single birthday card uh, that she ever got so or anniversary whatever she saved them all and ones from other people to her so I took these a long time ago and <clears throat> started to cut them up and um, so I could use them for bases yeah, that one is pretty would be I don't know you could write on it I guess but anyway that's what I you know these are with seven kids, she got a lot of birthday cards and Mother's Day and, you know, all the other stuff. My mother loved cards. Okay, <clears throat> so let's just use each one of these different things, if I can. I don't know. Oh, I know what I wanted to use is some frames. Um, I think these... Oh, I'm sorry, I'm blocking the light. I think most of these are pretty dark, but I'll leave them out and let me get oh, that one's good. That one's okay. I think these might have been from Lisa because it looks like her container, but I don't know if I want it fancy. Well, you never know. You never know. But I'm still looking for um, the white ones that I had. Mm. You know what? I should just pull the whole box out, right? Okay. 
You know I had a bunch of... Oh, here they are. Yeah. I don't need all of those, but... I keep forgetting I have frames, and I, I think they look so good on different things. Here's some more... Not even as a frame, but just an accent frame. Sometimes like, I use those little black ones that I make. All right. So, here we are. Just a few things to work with. I also uh, have some book pages, and this was some plain backs of the book pages that I can use for the backgrounds of... Uh, for the backs that I need to cover. Then I have these birds here. I'm not sure whose birds these are. These I know are Roxy Creations. Those are her birds. These are her birds too. But I'm, I don't think these are the same birds. I don't know. And then there's some flowers and some more birds. Okay. And that's what we're going to use is birds. Then I got some of these leaves um, that I thought I could add as far as the, you know, where the birds are. All right, let's cover, let's do this one first. So I don't want to use these to cover this. I need to, to cover this. And I got my Edith Holden book out thinking that I could use some of these pieces on there and get rid of this very last bit I have in this book. You can't I can't throw a one piece of Edith Holden away. Alright, let's do this. Let's see how much I can cover with this book page. Because the back is fine, right? Let's, um, I'm just going to put this over to the edge a little bit. I don't like that. Maybe I should just leave it whole. Hmm. Collage this one. It's just glue stick. I hate glue stick. Um, well, we have depression, or we have something that's. can do this without making a huge glue mess. Okay. I can just here. Is 
that how I did it? I had a couple spots. This is what takes time. It's probably better just to put a full the whole page on it. Let's see what can I put in that corner that might balance it. Some of I love the look of book pages on anything. I know that um, a lot of the journal makers that I've watched in the past years said if all else fails, put a piece of book page on <laughs> and it works. And Rachel, that's what she does um, at Roxy Creations. She pretty much puts a book page on everything. Or she even starts with a book page. And they always look so nice. Well, that didn't help me much. All right. So, the first thing I'm going to do is put something like that. And then, oh, I forgot I was going to get some little, well, let me see if I've got numbers numbers I think this is labels yeah I was trying to think if I had any other maybe I might use some of those things Need some stamps. <laughs> All right. All right. So let's just and I do need to figure out kind of what bird I want, but I don't think it's gonna matter. So let's see. Let's put a leaf in there. I've punched these out. I don't know the number of the, um, but I do know it was uh, Sizzix, uh, Tim Holtz. Um, and somebody used it and, and I asked him what it was and and so they said what it, they told me and I just ran and bought a bottom. And I haven't used them. I think I need a little darker, maybe. Uh, don't need birds with oh, that bird. Pretty with this pink. Look, I like that. Okay. And I don't know if I like that brown. That dark. I think these are from Tracy Fox, if I'm not mistaken. That's like too close to the same color. Some of the 
can see too dark. take all day but if we only get one made we get only one made right and this I'm not going to use to out put the bird up in here the vine They're all stuck together oh my gosh Help me. Okay, and then I could put something down here. So we have one, two, three. I could leave it at that. I think I'm going to leave it at these three, and then I'll come back. Maybe a little embellishing. Maybe a little piece like that wouldn't be too bad. All right, let's get this glued down. So I hope everybody's doing well. I don't think I asked. Everybody had a good holiday if you celebrate and we had Labor Day and my kids came over and did I think I told you guys that because I've answered uh, comments about it but it was so nice to have certain bushes cut because they they are on my windows when they hit my windows then there's ants in the bushes or hang out the bushes I don't know I hate them but um, then they come in the house and the um, pest control a long time ago told me make sure your bushes are not touching your house because the the easiest way for the ants to get in but I I don't totally agree with that I think they can come in I've seen them come in my back door oh yeah these are Rachel's because I remember putting them on this background and I can't remember why she did that oh because she wanted them sturdy so she could put them at the top of a pocket yes I do remember Okay, so I think he looks cute there. I do have some flowers if I wanted to. I could add a flower, maybe, I don't know. What happened last time was I, the the glue that I used it all they all came on glued. Well, after I cut them out, because I didn't glue every every bit of it. I'm gonna put that down there, even though I could probably use something else. I like it. 
Okay. And then this will get inked, but I think I'm going to round the corners. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just do the, the bigger corners. I kind of like the big corners. If I'm going to round a corner, that's the size I like. I'm going to sew around these two, you guys. So, Okay, so there's one done. All right, let me put my lid back on here, and let's see what else we can use. Okay, we've used these. Uh, let's use a... That one's back is not too bad. Purple, I don't know. All right, let's use this one. Um, so, I wonder, should I cover this whole thing with the book page? I think I'm gonna have to. I wonder if I have enough. here. Perfect. All right, so let's just glue this down to this Edith Holden page. It's like the first page in the book or something like that. Sides had it. Okay, let's get in here and these um, get, greeting cards are great because they're nice and firm. So when you get Christmas cards, I mean, you know, if you don't save them, if you save them, that's a whole different thing. But I don't even get Christmas cards anymore. Nobody sends them out. My daughter does. Well, I take that back. I do get a few, but they're all, I'm going to take this rough edge off. Um, but they're all, um... ink so I can get a better perspective. What are they? They're all uh, pictures of my grandkids and things like that. People. Alright, so let's see what I've got that frame there. And let's get this bird. I don't know what kind of bird it is. It looks like some kind of pelican or something. Some kind of a Okay, you have to fit. You have to fit. And maybe you should go that way. Because his feet, that makes his feet flat. I don't go crazy about that. Um, the feet. And I really can't cut it off. Okay, first of all, it needs something. Let's just see if it needs a little book page or something back there. What 
else is there that you can use for backgrounds if you don't have, you know, if you don't use a book page? just checking but I think that um, I think it's like a blue but it's um, more purple blue than it is blue blue and that's like totally turquoise I thought it was more blue aqua color No, I think that's the best one. Okay. All right, I'm just going to put, I don't know where these words came from. Different. something on the ground two pages standing on that. Um, let's see how what can he be standing on. And that's not bad except See what kind of greenery. I think I should cut that out. Hold on. A little bit of uh, surgery on this little guy. This blade was pretty sharp the other day when I used it, so we'll try it. Okay, I gotta get closer.
and a little bit of white won't be a problem. You guys, I'm just cannot get it to stay. <laughs> they have a uh, somebody was using reposition tape or I mean glue, and it worked really kind of cool. But you have to glue everything twice. All right, so now that and then. could cut the card shorter, couldn't I? That would be an ideal situation. Do I need to put that there? I think I need just to make the card shorter. Don't do this much. Let's see if I can cut it without moving everything. down. Where'd my glue book go? I just had it. I don't think this is it. be good to take the lid off. It might be good to use the right end. There's the glue book. <laughs> it's funny how you always uh, put things, I don't know about you guys, but I always throw it back to where I think it should be. And then that's the last place that I go to look for it. nice to use up this stuff. I, I don't think I maybe used one bird of those that I cut out from Rachel's
Must be getting close to lunch because I'm feeling hungry. Keep hearing noises, but the cats are all outside, so. And uh, my daughter came and picked up the uh, the baby kittens. The mother abandoned them. So, um, she came and took them to her house. She, she has like a little kennel thing. Not a, she, Actually, she has a big kennel. So all three of them can stay in there until she gets them acclimated to humans. Um, because she's afraid that she'll have a hard time get, giving them away if they're not held and are used to people. Because right now, they just like, their claws are out and ready to get you. Okay, let's put this guy on. I wonder if I can get all that off the back. be a while before I use these because to wait till spring I think but that's okay okay let's put this on Should have inked up the inside of the card here. The chickens and the roosters, the chickens today have been going on and on and on all morning so far and it, I don't know you know I'm about ready to go over there and say something to him I don't you know he's gone most of the day he's at work and his wife is no longer there they're divorced or getting divorced I don't know so you know it's like he doesn't have to listen to him all day every day because like I said he's not there and so but you know what I found too was um, um, do I want to round the corners on this one um, I don't know I think I'll just leave them for now. Maybe I'll round them later. Um, oh, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, so I have, I still have a stray cat. Um, and um, Toby hasn't been fixed yet. But the other stray, I think it's a female. But, you know, it's so expensive. It's not even about the money to get them. It's You can't find anybody to do it. Well, you can. You can have a vet. But you're talking 
lots of money for a vet to fix the cat. So you keep, you know, looking for low cost and they're hard to come by. But they do have medicine for birth control for cats, which I didn't know they had, but I looked it up online because the other day I said, I, why don't they just come up with some kind of birth control, you know, like your flea stuff. Well, that's what they have. They have birth control for cats. But you have to give it to them every week or I guess at least while they're at the time that they're ready to, you know, mate. Um, but I don't know when that time would be because I'm not, you know, with them all the time. All right. How many minutes have I been? Who 40. I wanted to get it one more done. Let's see. I do one of these that are very, let's see. Did I have any other, the only other card I had to do would be one of these which I never end up doing. That's why I have so many. Okay, that's so pretty. Oh. I think that's too big for a journal. Um, this is four and a half by five and a half. If I did it this way, it'd still be a journal card. Let's see if I can find a bird. I gotta fix this on the edge. That's kind of a pretty bird right there, that coloring. I don't know if I want a heart though. Is that green anywhere else? Don't see another green. They're all white. Ish, whitish. That looks pretty. Even that looks good. All right. Um, let's see what the bird looks like. Yep, this is one of Roxy's birds. So sweet on there. Okay, that one is going to have to have lace someplace. Do I need um, ivy or. Bird needs to be sitting on that heart. Hmm. That's so pretty. Okay. Um, I want to ink it. To ink all the stuff. I think these are on um, Taperology, these little uh, cutouts. But they're probably everywhere, I'm sure, but I don't see them on a digital kit where you can buy them and cut them out. They're like very intricate anyway. I do like that up there, and I like that. So I'm going to put that up there and just be done with it. Oh, this is a Tim Holtz card. Let's 
see, does this go under this? No. You know, I was wondering how long my videos could go for. Like, how much time could I do on YouTube? Like, can I do a two-hour video, do you think? I don't think so. But that would be kind of cool because I could do one video and you guys could watch like a half hour each day. <laughs> right? I wouldn't mind that. And it, it would be fun. I know I could just, you know make videos and um, that are only short but I can't get anything done fast enough that's why I'm saying that it takes to me too long to get Do that like that. Okay, I'm gonna put that bird right there. And I'll put that like that there. I sure wish that sticky stuff would have worked that I bought. I think it's from We Are Memory Keepers or something. It's like um, like stickers. You can lay this down on it and it will pick up the sticker part and then it's sticky again to lay it back onto a page or something. But it just did not work. Oh, is it this way? I think it's this way. Okay. I need to go get my nails done, but I don't want to. Because I don't like the way they did them last time, so it's like I need to find a different place. And, oh, I don't know. It's just a pain. Such a pain. And expensive. But... That is a very pretty bird. All right, one, two, three, four, five elements, because I thought I could put something down here. Um, these are all numbers. Seems like it should go there. One, two, three, four, five, six. How come, how can that work? Could have done that before, or I could have done it up here. Oh well. How about YouTube? <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I'm gonna call it a day there. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna put this on here, even though it doesn't seem like it should be. But it doesn't look out of proportion to me. I mean, I'm not sure why. Just like the color there. Okay, I'll cut this off. Yes, 
So my thought is this one would work as a um, pocket if I wanted it, or I can still use it as a journal card, you know, tucking it in that way. I'm just thinking, oh, I have this, because this is not very strong. I was thinking if I doubled it and use that for writing on the back. So I think that's the only one that I have that can be written on. I wish I had another green one. I think I'll save that gray. I'm just going to glue this to the back. And then I'll, I'll be sewing around these two. I'll have to do that before I take my picture. same size, a little bit different. That okay. helps because it felt like it was so flimsy. That's a lot better. Okay guys, so there's three um, cards with birds. I think I like them. I think they, I love, this is my favorite. I do love the peach though. I think I put something in there, I don't know. I didn't want to try to make it so it, it's like something's in those. I just wanted to use them for, a, you know, an extra element, embellishment. All right, so I'm gonna let you guys go. I'm gonna sew around these and then when I do uh, my picture, you'll see it sewn. I should show you at the end results in my next videos of how things turned out or if I did extra stuff or um, I just never think to do that. I put everything away and can't get this in because it's plugged up again. No. Let's see. It never did this. And I don't know why now. I could leave it un undone for a long time. Just want to get it in there so I can make sure. I just need to get. I don't know. All right. It's good now. All righty, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe and like and comment, okay? Uh, see you later.